All right, welcome back from that quick tips on how to set in lab school management system to run in a demo mode. Now, the next thing we are going to look at is how to um, set in lab school management system to run um, installation all over again, even though you have installed it, but we just learn how to set it to run the installer once again. Once we are just on the config file, I believe we just finalize that one and we know our hands are off from the config file and then we can move to something else to deal with. So still on the config file now, um, in lab school management system is run here. When we look at the config file, let me go back to config here, then roll down to the bottom. Now, when you look at um, the last one, which is config installed, it is true that here, in lab school management system is what? Installed. So it will skip the installer and then runs the program once it is true. Now we are going to set it to false and when it checks and it's false, then it calls in what? The installer. So first of all, I, I want to log out of um, in lab school management system first. And then we go back to my text editor, subline, which I like so much. Then we set it to false. That means that installer is not installed. So we need to run what? The installer page. So um, now that we are in labs, let me take off the sign in index and then hit on the enter key. And this expect to run in lab school management system installer all over again. And wow, see it. We are good to go with the installation of what? In lab school management system. And that is so good and so nice to deal with. So that is how to set in lab school management system to run in what? Uh, demo, uh, sorry, installer mode. So thank you. And stay tuned. Subscribe to my channel, like my videos, and comment. And don't forget my blog and my website, thevirussystems.com, and my blog, blog.thevirussystem.com. So stay tuned till my next video.